So more we be acquired by Nancy at this end so in a basin about how to work with email on HTML. Okay. So we might create a new HTML file and the title is adding images. So um at the body size I just have to um add some text B for uh, Okay, so I just add a heading in that um, image. Let me add some paragraphs, small and Okay, so after adding this one. We are going to add our images to an image to the web page. So to add an image now, the tag you use is IMG. IMG is the tag for images. Okay. So after selecting the IMG now, we're going to you have to provide an attribute which is the SRC. And SRC is the source where the image is located. Okay. Where the image is located, and we are going to use a relative path as we've already done. So, we were absolute and the relative path. So, because uh, the image is on our machine, and even in the same folder, we are using the relative one. So, um, at the source side, now we type the folder head the image is getting, and in my case, the image is kept in a folder called images so after specifying the folder you bring a forward slash and the name of the image or the file mine is this with the file extension and i jpg okay so this is it so at this point i've been able to import an image with the image about the web page name. so let's go to the web browser to check okay so we are still using the index so we open the web browser to see how it looks so this is what we did in the image now the bottom and on the line and you didn't buy okay so this one form and we have another form you can also use the image as a link within the website okay let's say um this uh, in a by they provide a hyperlink when you yeah previously so the anchor we are using the anchor tag this is the a tag Okay, so with the angle tag, you need to specify the reference, the HF, and in our case, the image is located in the folder as the same as you now, so you can even copy this one and paste it there. Okay, then we can the a URL, it is the location of the image name right there, and you can give it a name, let's say, um, view image. image okay so this is what we are having now so let's refresh and see so after refresh we want to you know hypertext do or anything as the image so because uh, you are using any target the uh, target as an attribute in the hyperlink image you both do image now if it's do image you know sir Page in our you see, and there is a page in our national review. Image. So we we'll go back to the sublime text and make adjustment. So at the h you no know, anchor on the side, you know, target me, you have to make it blank. That's underscore blank. Then I be a big in a blank space, okay? So let's refresh it and check. Okay, refresh now. 
Okay, one say a day in a new um tab am I? Okay. So with the image you can insert it directly or you can use it as a link in the page. But this is the put image image now and I will see add image now. Then you can add some CSS to either make the image um smaller in size or you can change the border. You let's try something, let's try and change um the border. So with the CSS in the HTML, okay, so yeah, you can do it at the heading side. You can also do it within the line. You add it as an attribute, okay? So let's try and add star. And the star we are going to use is a border. And border radio. Let's make it, um, let's say, 10 pixels. Okay. Okay. And then the borders will actually be because of how to invade. And even with this one, we can make it, okay, let's make it in a circle form. So we will make it 50%. Now you say, is the 50% of the size, original size? Okay, let's refresh. And you see, I make it in an, an oval shape. So we are not doing CSS bar. In case you want to add some things, you can just add um, borders. You can add the width. You can add the size and many things. With me, I remember between this one. You can add um, border color. You can make it say yeah. But there's no percent a year red. You see? Dark red. And even the border size um size. Uh, you can change the border size. And like style size maybe yeah, you can do it here. So border red, you can even make it let's say um forty depending on how you want to make it here. That is special. Okay, so you can refresh the page. And you see the red is around it, as you can see. You see, yours is dark red now. See now, you can't perceive it well. So, the main thing we did was adding an image to our web page. And we can add the image as um, a main part. Say, the audio man at them, and I said, you can add it to the Anchor, so just referencing it. Okay, I can see you in our next video. Bye bye.